Rasty McGibbon with Arizona State University Women's Division One head coach Lindsay Ellis. Lindsay, thanks for coming on. Um, program is how many years old? Seven years. Seven years and the first time at uh, Nationals. Yes. Yep. How special is it? I think it's amazing. I mean, a lot of the pool of teams here are East Coast and Midwest teams. So just to have a representative from the Southwest Desert is pretty cool. You, you had told me before we came on, uh, a former player at uh, Miami of Ohio and uh, then uh, graduated and, and, and take me from there back to Arizona and the formation of the team. Yeah, so my junior year, we won the national championship at Miami and it coincided with the men's national championship at Arizona State. So I saw some of my guy friends win and I was like, why couldn't I stay home too? And um, the whole idea started brewing and here we are now. <laughs> When, when, when you look back, are you able to kind of retrospectively see milestones, not only in the formation of the team, but getting yourself to, to, to be a participant at Nationals? Absolutely. I mean, I think even just in terms of recruiting and the teams that we're playing and things like that, it's, it's progressed tremendously even in the past just two seasons. Tell, tell me about hockey uh, in the Southwest. Yeah, it's, um, you know, it's a little obviously behind the rest of the country and things like that, but um, there's only one girls hockey association in the entire state, which is crazy. So, um, you know, hopefully in the next 10 years that grows a bit more. No secret, <laughs> you are one of the few women head coaches coaching a women's team. Um, how do you feel perspective wise that gives you an advantage? Um, I or, or do you feel yeah, it gives you an advantage? I don't know, an advantage. I think definitely in terms of interpersonal relationships, I probably have a better relationship in terms of female versus male. And yeah. I joke all the time that I have 30 children. Right. So, um, yeah, I mean, maybe just the... Some of the girls say you're not joking when you say that. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, I mean, maybe just the personal relationships. I think I probably have an upper hand on that over a male. But um, coaching-wise, I don't think it's much different. Do, do you feel that it does uh, give you a higher level of identification having... Uh, not only being a woman, but 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 having been down the road and played at the you know national tournament level. Um, I'm, maybe yeah. yeah. I mean, I think it's really cool that you know I've been in the same situation as a player and been successful. So I think in terms of that, I can connect and try and teach them those kind of things. And obviously, the men can never say they did that at right. the women's level. So I think in terms of that, probably. Um, tell me what it's like for your girls, what comments you've heard uh, being at Nationals and just the experience. You know, you've come kind of coast to coast, corner to corner from the southwest to the northeast, yeah. <laughs> um, you, you know, and what, 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 what have the girls said so far? They love it. I mean, they love being in this atmosphere. Our, we were the first game of the day yesterday and they wanted to be here all day after. They kind of right. want to take it in and they just love the experience. And a lot of the girls, I mean, we have girls from like 12 different states and three provinces. So we kind of have an all-inclusive North American team and they know players on a bunch of these teams. So it's really cool. What do you think that your appearance here at National does for uh, not only growing hockey, but more specifically growing women's hockey geographically in that part of the United States? I think it's really important, not only at the ACHA level, but also NCAA. If you look at Division Three and Division One, they're all the right side of the country. So yeah. I think you know, I think in the next five to ten years, you're going to start seeing universities wondering why they're not having Division One and Division Three college hockey for women out west. Well, excellent. Lindsay, thank you so much for your time today. Good luck in your game today and good luck the rest of the tournament. Thank you. Lindsay Ellis, head coach, Arizona State University Women's Division One.